Well, I'll start with this. Hello, everyone. How is everyone doing today? Today is 2nd of August, and I hope you all are having a fantastic day today. We are playing Chicory today. We are not playing Billy Bust Up. Actually, no, you wouldn't have seen Trails of Cold Steel. You, sorry, I will have Trails of Cold Steel 1 up, but it won't send me play Billy Bust Up, so forget about that. This is Chicory. We, where, where are we? So, last episode... We helped Chicory get out of her funk, get out of her slump, and realize that, yeah, she can still help. She can still do things. Yes, even though these dark trees are part of her, that came from Crab as well. And by dodging Chicory's feelings, we have helped her. It's not how that works in real life, but if you watch the episode, you'll see. After getting Chicory back to understanding that the world is not doomed, Chicory has then agreed to help us. And said, you know, I'm going to help you be a wielder, so you need to take the four wielder challenges. We already did one as part of our story, and we are doing number two. A really big conclusion, a uh, big, a big, a uh, conclusion that Chicory though made was after I helped Chicory get through her feelings, her and Crab talked together, and Crab said, hey, I'm also seeing, like, these things, and they're horrible to me. Which then got Chicory thinking that the issue isn't us individually, but the brush. And the brush is making us feel bad, and the brush is taking our negative emotions and amplifying them to the real, to the physical world. And yeah, that's what happened. Well, let's let's go, shall we? Um. Ah, I'm awesome. Da -da -da. Oh, I get it. I know what you want me to do. Okay, I got the shit. Aha! I got a winter, but I can't jump on this. I have to wait. There we go. Bastard. Ah! Oh, wait, Darren. Wrong way. Wrong direction. I don't want to play. There we go. Okay, this is interesting. So it doesn't fall? Hmm, that work? It almost does. I mean, I guess I can go up there now. Oh, it's Chicory. Hello. I was wondering when you'd catch up. How did you climb up here so fast? You don't even have brush powers. I've got strong legs. You feel ready to rise. You feel ready to rise to the status of wielder? I'm not sure I even understand what that means. So I guess the answer is no. When I think about a wielder, I don't think of someone like me. I think about someone strong and cool and confident. You thought I was a good wielder, right? The best! But now that you know me, do I really seem cool and confident to you? Well, 
<laughs> I do think you're strong, Chickory. You felt so terrible and frightened, but you're still here helping me. That's strength. Well, you're still here too, helping me. I understand what you mean about uh, the strong wielder. That's who I wished I was too. I was trying so hard to look perfect, but I was so lonely. And afraid that if anyone ever saw the real me, the spell would be broken, and no one would care about me anymore. That's what I thought had happened. When you saw me in the corruptions, I didn't think you'd ever come back. Chicory, you don't have to be perfect for anyone to care about you. I guess I came back because I thought we were friends. Thanks for staying there and talking with me, even though I was horrible to you. I didn't deserve it, but thank you. I don't want things to get that bad again. Chicory, I don't really know how to put this, but I'm glad I got to see the real you. I don't think I realized how little I knew about you before this. You felt so above me back then. I know that's not the truth. I know you're just another person like me, but you're still also someone I admire. Who I want to learn from, flaws and all. You don't have to hide that from me. I want to be able to be there for you when you need it. Thanks, Crab. That means a lot, and same to you. I'm going to keep climbing. Good luck with the rest, Crab. I'll see you at the top. That was nice. Boop. Why can't I color in this cloud? I'm going to color in the cloud, damn it. Anyway. Alright. Wait. That means we go this way. What do we get here? Oh. Oh, so I had I had to go to this point. Oh, interesting. No, come back. Boop. Oops. No, damn it. There we go. That's one. Can I jump to the other side? No? Okay. Oh no, I missed! Damn. Oh, is it now? Alright, one second. Alright, everyone, it is 15 minutes past the half hour. You all know what that means. That is time for the first tip of the day. This is when we as a community come together and do one physical action together to make us feel more like a community, more close-knit, you know? That physical action is we're going to cheer, which means that y'all need something to drink, so if y'all could go ahead and grab your favorite drink of choice, whether that may be... Coffee, tea, beer, water, juice, kombucha, papaya juice, watermelon juice, infused water, infused milk, infused coffee, mixed berry juice, chai tea, lemonade, scotch, gin, whiskey, rye rum, bourbon, brandies, bailey, chippers, and cognac, wine, champagne, and moonshine, absinthe, or sake. Is everyone. Cheers. I'm making it through another day. Dink a dink. That sounded weird.
This is actually my first sip of coffee for the day. I usually cheat and have a bit of coffee beforehand to wake up. But I have uh, come to figure out. It's that I'm hungry in the mornings and I don't need caffeine. I mean, I still enjoy the caffeine in the morning like I am now, but having food in the morning helps. Helps a lot. I quite enjoy food in the morning. The hard aspect about eating in the morning is that I'm not hungry. Well, today I was. But usually I don't wake up hungry? Well, no, hmm. Yesterday. Yesterday when I woke up. I didn't feel hungry, but I still ate about, I don't know, 30 to 40 minutes after I woke up because I felt hungry after 40 minutes. Today, I was hungry when I woke up, so I ate and also took my shower. Eating breakfast helps me feel so much better during the day. It helps me feel more awake. Because yeah, people would say, Oh, the clouds move at different speeds depending on which way the wind's blowing. That is adorable. As people say, oh man, yeah, I don't... I don't, uh... I don't eat breakfast. So I try, I try to be like this. I try to be like the people that say they don't eat breakfast. Because if I didn't eat breakfast, do you know what that meant? It meant that I didn't have to spend money on breakfast, because food's expensive now. But just this week, eating breakfast in a good breakfast, not a uh, bagel or toast. Uh, I, have a, I have a burrito. I have a breakfast burrito. It's rice, eggs, steak, bell peppers, and a little bit of spinach. It's quite good. But it's enough to make me feel full and energized in the morning. What I don't like, though, is because um, I eat, my stomach gets a little bigger because food. And on some shirts, I can stretch the shirt and it does not make me feel good. And that's about it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of first up today. Oh, right. Let's talk about Billy Bust Up. Billy Bust Up is a 3D, plat 3D rhythm platformer. I think that's the best way to describe it. It's so cool. It looks good so far. It raised a good amount of money on Kickstarter, and I've backed it on... Uh, I paid them on Patreon, so I could uh, get an early executable to play. <sighs> I'm excited for that. I will play that sometime. I asked them to give me the download, the stream key. The Steam key. However, the people who replied to give me the Steam key don't usually reply until a Friday or a Saturday. So I'm not going to get a Steam key till probably Friday, and which means I will do Billy Bust Up most likely in a week. But I am super excited. My back is killing me. My wife bought me, um... Cassette Beasts. It's good. I played it. Going, all right, let's 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 listen to this. Let's see what it's like. No, listen. Let's go into this. What is it like? It's grown on me. Yeah, it's really good. The music is good. Pixel art is. It takes some time to get used to, especially how the monsters look. Uh, because if you played Pokemon, I played Pokemon. I went into this mindset of Pokemon. It's not Pokemon. It's, it's good so far. I, I quite enjoy it. I like the open world aspect of monster hunting. It's very nice. All right, let's go. I don't know. It's it, 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 saying it's very nice doesn't even seem to do it justice. It's some cassette beasts. You go around open world. You can capture monsters. Uh, yes, everything is based on a cassette tape. 
So, to capture monsters, you record their essence on the cassette tape. Adorable. When the cassette tape can evolve, they're remastered. To heal a cassette tape, you rewind it with a pencil. When a cassette tape has no health, you have to repair it because it's broken with a repairing tool. <sighs> the music is good, the story is good so far. There's a lot of nice quests. It's just super awesome. I would say give Cassette Beasts a try. Alright, I don't know. I feel like I can do more for Cassette Beasts. I can't think of what, what to say about it right now. Okay, uh, oh my god. Oh, I get it. Wait. Thank you. No! Fuck you. No! Damn it. I got a fuzzy jacket. Damn it. Oh my god, am I at the top? Damn it. Boop. Boop. Damn it. Boop. There we go. There we go. Aha! Haha! Alright. I thought we were done. Fun. I enjoyed that. I hope you did too. Uh, do I, I have to paint this now. Ugh. Ugh. Wait, 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 Flaps. All right. All the music got quiet. We're getting close. Degree. Oh, you're almost there. The peak is just up ahead. You can relax in this spring too if you want, but don't ride. The waterfall down. It's a shortcut to the bottom of the mountain. Unless you feel like climbing it again. Okay, I'll see you up ahead. Look at Shakery being so nice. Nothing? Let's
let's go, shall we? Oh. You did it, Crab. This is the peak. It's so quiet. Yeah, I love it. There's one last part to this trial. We're gonna sing a song together. <laughs> what? I'm not much of a singer. That's okay. It's an ancient wielder anthem. I don't remember the words though, so we might have to just make it up. We're meant to stand at the edge and look out to the view as we sing. Make your way to the edge when you're ready. Head to the edge of the peak when you're ready. I'm excited to hear your singing voice. Ready to finish this trial and move on? Yeah. Yeah. Hi, Terivo. Hi, Terivo. Chapter 7, The Wielder Trials 2. Let's go. You had nothing to worry about, Crab. Your singing voice is really nice. Thanks. Yours too. Congratulations, Crab. You just finished your first wheel to trial. That's a huge first step. I'm glad I got through it too. Well, I don't know about you, but I'm feeling a lot more confident to take out the other three at the other corners of Picnic. I'll be waiting at the next one. Oh, did we not do one? I thought we did one already. Oh, all right. I guess we still have three more to go. Oh, 
It's a catastrophe! The resort is done for, I tell you, done for! Now, now, that may be a bit of an exaggeration. I would never, ever exaggerate! We are the victims of grass, a little, little, grand larceny. All the furniture in our presidential suit was stolen. Everything is hopeless. I don't know anything about investigating. I'll try to help. Oh, thank goodness. Please come see for yourself. Wow. It's really, yes it is. And VIP pests, VIP guests are coming any time. No, you've got to begin the investigation right away. Luckily, I've seen enough TV show on how this works. You need to take photos of evidence. Okay, sure. What's evidence? Why, there's a piece of evidence right here. Open your camera, zoom in to snap a picture and collect the evidence. Including this, I imagine there's four pieces of evidence around Simmer Springs. Good luck. Ah, uh, one second. Okay, I have to close this person down. I can still hear them. I don't want them in my stream. Actually, one more thing. If you have any spare decor, could you place them here? I'll remain here to oversee the redesign of the presidential suite. Thank you. You're welcome. Damn it. How do I... Aha! Yes! Just like that! Now go find the other pieces of evidence! I'd like to ask you a few questions. Of course. Where were you when all this stuff went missing? I was on a break. I'd stepped out to get a breath of fresh air. When I came back, Mrs. Butterscotch was in a fit. That's when I found out what happened. A likely story. I know, it is very likely. It's very likely and also true. Well, alright. Let me know when you found all the evidence. <laughs> Better, come here! Thank you. Where does this go? There we are, little girl. Boy. Can I go this way? No. Can I go this way? Um. Cool. I guess I would go into a uh, um uh scrub caverns maybe. I, don't know. I guess I can swim, so why not see where this takes me? Huh? Oh, I can climb up these things. Where's the bus stop? If no one knows about uh, this way. Bus stop. Oh, I can move the window. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's adorable. That's cute. Okay, so I am now in this corner. Is this where I actually need to be? Or is it up here that I need to be? Who knows? It's 
find out, shall we? All right, there we go. I can do this. Um. Is there a different way? You know what this thing reminds me of? Paper Mario and Paper Mario Sticker Stars. And just so quiet and lively is what it reminds me of. Okay. Well. Oh, man. Um. What's up, sweetie? Hope the drive went well. to be able to get up there? Like, how do I do what? Dum, bum, bum. Some traffic. I'm sorry. Can I go in here? Do you do anything? Right now, please. Oh, you're the litter person. Okay. You're the litter person. I don't give a fuck about you. There another can I I can't fall down can I? Am I supposed to fall down this? I mean that's a corner, so maybe we can go. Oh, that's water. Sure. Let's go there instead. Um is a bench. Mm. 
Okay, let's just... Place. Don't ask me why I said it that way. Because even I don't know. Where am I? Oh, I'm right there. Okay. Get, get up, crab. Thank you. All right. Let's continue, shall we? the edge the big drink Can I just do this that was satisfying Haha, <laughs> sunny tea. It's like sunny tea with the tea instead. Oh my god. Oh, am I at the corner? Chicory. How do I get over? Where? Where? Am I? I'm right. Oh, I'm right. He oh, here I am. Okay. I need to somehow get over there. How I look. No, 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 no. Litter. We gotta pick up the litter. Be good citizens. Yeah. There you are, crab. There's a trial all the way out here. Yep. Welcome to Spoons Island. The theme of this trial is finding your path as a wielder. Or something like that. Locating this place is just the first step. There's a lot of old wielder stuff here. You'll have to find your way to the heart of the island, and, well, I'll leave the rest to you. See you up ahead! Go. Oh.
right. Island. Oh, my back. Oh, my God. Oh. 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 So, I have, ever since getting back from India, wanted to make filter coffee. Now, to somebody who's never heard of filter coffee before, you might be like, Darren, what the fuck? Isn't coffee already made in a filter? For some reason, it's called filter coffee. I don't know why it's called filter coffee, but the coffee is just a strong shot of espresso mixed, brewed with chicory, and then adding boiling milk to boiled milk. I know it sounds weird to boil milk. Boiled milk. So what I do is I make a coffee in a mako pot. Mako? Mako? I like mako pots when I say Final Fantasy VII. And that gives me something a bit less... Not as concentrated as espresso, but as close to espresso as, as, as I can get without getting a dedicated machine. I brew that with coffee beans and chicory. To that, I boil milk. I have a 6% milk, it's amazing. And then boil it, then put it in. It's really good. It's quite, I'm so happy. Because when I was in India, I, you know, since I worked for Microsoft, I, I still do now, according to this video, when I, when I'm recording this. And when I went to India, I had filter coffee every day because in India, in the Microsoft Center in India, I got, we got a daily allocation of rupees we could use at the restaurants, and they're all subsidized. They're pretty cheap. It was great. So I had like two to three filter coffees a day. Oh my god, I, I miss India. It was so fun. It was just, ah oh man, I miss India so much. Anyway, that's filter coffee, and filter coffee is amazing. All right. Okay. There's no use. There's no prompt to use. I don't believe there is a use button. There is move, interact, interact K, which is impressive. Paint, erase, yeah. I don't know, we'll have to see. Oh, I know, here are the controls for that. Oh, it switched! litter oh no gotta collect the litter everyone here we go 
Oh man, this game is just all the puzzles, all the time. Oh, I know. Aha! I am, I bash. Oh, damn it, Darren. There we go. No. Oh, Spiffy. Okay. So, uh, oh, how do I? Here we go. There um. we go. Okay. up. Bring that over here. Drop, drop, go. Bump a dump. Go up. Go up. Thank you. Go up, my dude. Go. Ah, here we go. Down and up. I'm awesome. this way. Music changed. Can I swim here? Maybe? Oh, hey, crap! Oh, hi, Chicory! I didn't even see you there. Oh my god. It's good to stop and clear your mind a while. The lagoon is nice and warm, just how I remembered it. How's it coming, crab? Think you found your path as a wielder? 
I'm still figuring that out. Before this, I was just your janitor. When I think what my path is, it feels like I'm here by pure accident, so... I guess I'm faking it for now. I'm trying to make it become real. Well, I'm gonna go to the bathroom, then I'll be right back. What was your path as a wielder? I wanted it my whole life. And at this trial, I felt completely ready. It meant everything to me. Maybe too much. Definitely too much. I can never live up to my own vision. Feeling ready is overrated. But, well, I wish I felt ready. My whole life, I've never known where I'm going. You make it look so easy. You wanted to be a wheeler and you were. But I never knew what I wanted to be, so how can I be anything? Wow, man, that's true. It almost feels like you're mad at me for making you the wheeler. I'm not mad at you. I'm I'm mad at myself for not being the person I wish I was. Did you like being a janitor? Uh, I did like aspects of it. I like that my tasks were clear. I like that I could put my whole self into it. And I didn't have to worry about the outcome. You know when you're making progress. And it makes the world better in the tiniest way. Like picking up litter or finding lost kids. <laughs> Why do you sound so sad saying it? Because it feels like it meant it. I'm not even a real artist. I just do things for other people. So you like to do things for others. That's an amazing thing to know about yourself. But that's not what I want to know. I want to want things for myself like you do. I'm embarrassed. Sometimes it feels like a joke that's gone on too long. Like you'll take the brush back and laugh. <laughs> you really thought someone boring like you could be a wielder? I, I know that's not what you really think. But... <sighs> That's basically what you said to me in the swamp, and I guess I never got over it. I'm genuinely sorry, Crab. I wish you'd never seen that. But there's nothing boring about you at all, Crab. I just... I wish I had the capacity you do to be there for other people. And if you ask me, that's a great way to be a wielder, too. It's not just about making art. You're creating a better world for everyone. Being able to listen to do things for others, that doesn't come easy to me. It takes on my energy just, energy just to deal with myself. Don't... You shouldn't be like me. That's not what makes a real artist. <laughs> Definitely not, not what makes a great wielder. You really think that? I do. I understand you feeling like you don't belong, but well... I've screwed up a lot. I thought I didn't belong anymore either. But I'm still here. We just have to keep trying, right? That was something you showed me. Do you feel chicory as in the game as a whole, or the chicory the character right now? That was something you showed me. It what makes you better than me. Don't give up just yet. I'm getting kind of chilly. I'm gonna get out now. I'll see you at the end, okay? Good luck. I see, I see. Yeah, that was a nice heart to heart. I'm glad I came this direction. I like a phone booth. What is this bullshit? It's like a little puzzle! Oh, this is so cute! Kind of. Oh, 
Oh, because this seems to disappear. Okay, that's why I can't just walk through it. It's like gunpowder? Either way. Okay. I broke it. When did I break it? Have they? I had no idea. I haven't been in the library for a while. There we go. This game is just... Jeez, okay. Um... Wow! Okay, this... I know what... I know what this... I, I, I have an idea of what needs to happen. Um... Those go away. And then I need to... Those two need to go down. There we go. Uh, that one? Yeah, all right. Jump. 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 And... Up. There we go. Man, it sucks you didn't have, didn't have a bird's eye view of this. Oh, oh! Fuck! Okay. Derivative, come here. Derivative, come on, baby. Come here, Derivative, good girl. Say hi. Say hi. Thank you, Derivative. I appreciate it. Thank you, Derivative. All right, Derivative. All right, Derivative. I know, she's a floof. Are you a floof? No, or just a floof, yes, floof, huh? Oh, is that going, is that going scratches? Is that going scratches? Oh, is it going back scratches? <sighs> okay. Not exactly what I wanted, but there we go. Oh. Oh. 
You gotta get, you gotta get the treasure. No, we, that's not the right wall, but we gotta get the treasure. Can I, wait, what? Okay. Mm, when we roll to get the treasure, we gotta get the treasure. Boop. I didn't just jump across it. Um. Treasure, I'm coming! I'm coming! No! Just a pretty serious game. There! God! Treasure! I got an ahoy! Okay, now it's time to connect all this. Um. Bland now that I got rid of all the color. We start there. Uh, we need to do that one. We go up that way. That goes there. To there. And goes down. Zoosh, right? That works. Okay, now we need to get the other ones. Got that. All right, so Little, little, little. Okay. 
That way, that way, that way, back to there. Uh, <sighs> that answers that up. Uh, that goes the. What if we do that? No, no, no. Um. Okay, well, let's think of this backwards. So if we start here, we get to here. Moves over there. Side up, that moves up there. So confident. Is that not the right answer? No! Really? Ah, that's what it was. I got an Avost. Okay, now we have to make everything work. Again. Can trees get in the way? down then. Oh, that's where we came from. Okay. Alright. Oh. Oh. Where am I? Crap! 
job! It's a great view, isn't it? Is this the end? Almost. You've got one final thing to do here. This place is where every wielder paints their self-portrait. The one that hangs in the wielder tower. So, when you feel ready, go to that canvas and paint yourself. This is the moment you'll capture forever, when you're no longer just you, but a true wielder. Try not to be nervous. Uh. We're gonna race on dragon. We're gonna go like that. We're gonna go like that. That's yeah, not And I know it's not supposed to be perfect. Right? That's all right. I understand that. Just make sure I don't have any beanies at like 9:30. Oh, it's Ando. Oh, I forgot your uh, your hat, huh? You got a hat there. I got a second eye. And we got a little. There. And we got a little, little pouch. And then I got little Velcro straps. And it was whoosh. Yeah, it was good enough. Yeah. All right. 
the wheel of trials trace. Hmm. Nice job, Crab. I take your portrait back to the wheel tower. I am excited to see how it looks with the others. But anyway, you did it, Crab. That's your second wheel or trial down. Halfway there now. Do we done it in no time? Almost feels like we should celebrate, doesn't it? Celebrate? How? I have no idea. I never did fun stuff when I was a wielder. Or when I was in school. Or basically ever. I don't know where people go to just hang out, but we should go to one of those. Well, there's the... Ooh, donuts! Oh, sure, that works. Whichever place you want. Let's meet there. See you soon. Um. Oh, hey, look. An exit. Aha. Look at that. I am somewhere there. We're gonna go to the holy shop. There it is. I need to get over there. I need to get to potluck. No, keep painting. Thank you. Wait, Darren. Is there anywhere I can go here that I couldn't? Because now I can swim. Yar mighty. Do you remember? Y'all might not remember this. I don't know. I don't know if you've never even played this video game at all. I don't even know what it's called. <sighs> there was a video game my sister had on the PC. This was when, like, this was like the Windows 98 uh, XP wasn't a thing yet. So probably 98. My sister had a computer. And a game she had was on the CD-ROM. And it was like traveling through history. I don't remember. Um, there was one level you could say was... um. You had to spear fish. I was very bad at it. You'd see this, you know, CG water, and you would have this CG spear, and you try to spear CG fish. I remember also part of this game was like a lion, no, a tiger head talking to you, like in a mural, like not a mural, like a stone relief. Is that how I use that word? Um, that's not how you spell it. Uh, oh my. Fuck. I don't want to read life. Uh, relieve, be live, relive, lift. Oh my god, fucking damn it. Oh no. Uh, relieve. Um, more definition.
missions. Oh my god. Okay, we have Cause Spain Relieve. Relieve. Okay. okay. Oh, archaic. Make something stand out. I don't know. Anyway. Uh. Yes. So. Um, I also remember, like, the siege. I'm seeing on, like, Oregon Trail, but not as intense, but you had to trade things while you're on the Oregon. It was weird. I don't know what game this was. It was for Windows 95. However, there were other arcade games that I remember playing. One of them was, um... That Thor game that I can't remember off the top of my head. I played it... Like two years ago, I found it online. It's free where you can totally play it. It just sounds really bad, actually. Um, anyway. Yeah. Anyway, so what did we get to the, What did we get done today? We finished two of the four wielder trials. We scaled the mountain. Sung with chicory. We then found a beach. Which wasn't really in the corner of the world, but close enough. And got to the heart of the island and made our own self-portrait that I bet if we go back to the Wielder Tower, we will find there. Next week, hopefully, I'll get the stream key for Billy Bump Off and play that for a bit before switching to Chicory because it is not a full game yet. And I don't think it will take up an hour and a half. Otherwise, everyone, on Friday, I will be playing Trails of Cold Steel, but I will be starting from the beginning because the audio recording was absolute shit and I don't want to put that up online. Anyway, is there someone we can raid? Oh, he didn't steal them. Boot. Is there anyone streaming Chicory? There is. You too, sweetie. Uh, a German person. Um, El Elbism. The fuck is Elbism? I have one hundred eighteen views. What was it fire? What was it in my dream? <laughs> um, is that it? Is that the only person? There's another person. Is that Germany? Is that German? Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, looks like they're they're doing. S oh, they just started. Okay. Yeah, it's German. German. Okay, we are going to do Elfism. Uh, because he's streaming chicory, so I guess we will we will raid him because because it's chicory. Anyway. Lurkers who are lurking, thank you. Uh, you. It's only one person. It's one person, so I don't think it matters. Alright, everyone, I hope you all have an. Uh, fuck. Lurkers who are lurking, thank you so very much for lurking. Watchers who are watching, thank you so very much for watching. Bots who are bought and thank you so very much for body. Love you all, and I will see you all tomorrow. No, Friday!